So you want to create a tab for every month in Google Sheets. We're going to do this with App Script automatically or programmatically. Go up to extensions, App Script. When you do that, you'll have function, my function. We are going to write this whole function ourselves right here, right now. We're going to call this create every month. And we're going to need a couple of variables. Variable month equals zero. This is actually January. All the months are numbered zero through 11. Variable year equals 2025. You can change this to 2026 or 2027, whatever your year is in now. We're going to create a loop, a while loop. While month is less than 12, we're going to do something. We're going to be executing, creating a new sheet. Well, how do we loop back through this? We're going to have at the end month plus plus. So inside of this loop, we're going to first have this month as zero. Check it in this while do whatever we want it to do. And then at the end, we're going to have it iterate or add one. Add one from zero is one. Is that less than 12? Yes, keep going. If not, stop. So what are we going to iterate through? We're going to create a sheet. We need variable ss equals spreadsheet app dot get active spreadsheet. Variable ss dot insert sheet. And we need a sheet name here. The sheet name we're going to get from a date. So variable sheet name equals utilities dot format date. We need a date here. So let's create a variable date. variable date equals new date year from up here, this variable month from the looping variable that we started at zero and one. So we're just going to name it the first of the month. So we're going to put that variable here format date. We can put a time zone if you want GMT plus zero or whatever you, your time zone is. And we need to format this date in text. In our particular case right now, I'm going to choose three M's or months. That's going to be the first three letters of the month that we're creating this sheet name. And I'm only going to select one D. That's just a single D. At the bottom here, we just have to delete this variable. We just have to run this here. Command S, Control S if you're on a non Mac or save project up here in Drive. And let's run it and see what happens. You may have to authorize this once you execute it for the very first time, but every time after that, you don't have to. Let's go back to our sheet and see that we have every single month, January 1st through December 1st, 12 of them already created in one click. But let's say we want to actually include the year in the sheet name. Let's add to this format hyphen Y, 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 Y. That's four Y's. Save it. And we can actually run this again. Yeah, run this again. It's executed. And we can go back and see January 1st, 2025, all the way to December 1st, 2025. If you want to change this one to two or five or seven, whatever you want to, probably not 30 or 31, because those are not dates in February, let's say, or every month. But there you go you can now create a tab for every single month of the year of any year you want even the year thousand if you wish make sure you subscribe here to better sheets on youtube for more automations more awesomeness make your sheets way better make your life better in google sheets